In this clip I will use the Riemann sums to define the average value of a function over some closed interval. So here again we have the usual grid that we make out of the interval AB of n equal length intervals and from each such interval xi minus 1 xi of length delta x we sample some point xi star. Now the average of n values x1 star if we do so if we select xi star from each of such intervals we generate fx1 star until fxn star then the average of course is just the sum of the function values divided by n. Yeah, so here we have fx1 star plus etc until fxn star and divided by n. Now we're going to write this a little bit different and we're going to use that uh, b minus a divided by n. Yeah, so we have n intervals that this equals delta x. Yeah, so we picked we sampled from n intervals and the relation between b, a and, and delta x is as follows. Then n equals b minus a divided by delta x. Yeah, so we still have the same sum, fx1 star, etc, etc, until fxn star. And now we divide by n, which equals b minus a divided by x, delta x. Okay, but this can of course be written differently, so this equals 1 over b minus a times the sum of the function values fxi star times delta x. So this almost looks like a kind of a Riemann sum where 1 over b minus a times the Riemann sum that we defined earlier, so the sum over i equals 1 to n fxi star times delta x. So if we take a limit for n to infinity and uh, decrease the length of the intervals and keep sampling points xi star from each of those, then we end up with 1 over b minus a times the definite integral from a to b fx dx. Well, this will be taken as a definition of the average value of f over the closed interval a, b. Yeah, so we can do this if only f is a continuous function or has just a finite number of discontinuities. Yeah, then we may define the Riemann integral, the definite integral from a to b, and consequently the average value of this function f over the closed interval a, b.